G'day guys, Jeff Ware, bikereview.com.au. Beautiful autumn day, where else would you want to be? Uh, except at Sydney Motorsport Park on the South Circuit, riding around on the KTM 1290 Super Duke R. We've got a few versions here today, so we're riding the standard one mostly, but we've also got one with the track kit on it that's got the up and down quick shifter and a few other electronic modes, so and an acro pipe as well. So I've been having a lot of fun. We're on the standard Metzler M7RR tyres, which are not a track tyre, but once we've done a few changes to the suspension today, we've actually got them handling reasonably well, so we're able to push and have a bit of fun. So, yep, an awesome bike. I've done about six sessions. So I'll quickly run you over a few of the changes. There's a lot of small revisions to the engine. Um, it's got just over 170 horsepower, around 150 Newton meters of torque. Uh, electronics wise, it's got, you know, the full deal. Your, your traction control, your ABS, um, cornering ABS, and all the usual KTM goodies that you'd expect from KTM, like high spec WP suspension, Brembo brakes, all the usual stuff you'd expect. So what's it like to ride? Well around here we're using second, third and fourth gear. Um, you know you can use that lazy torque of the motor if you want to. I'm using third and fourth gear mostly and just second in a couple of the hairpins and it just pulls like a train as you really would expect. Um, it's almost super bike style power. Um, but the top end is still exciting and it's super, super revvy up top. So, um, you know, <coughs> my background, sports bikes. I've kind of moved on to naked bikes nowadays because uh, I am 41. And uh, this kind of bike suits someone like me perfectly um, because it's upright, it's comfortable, uh, it'll be great around town. Um, but it gives you that thrill of a super bike. So having lots of fun on it today, absolutely hammers. So some of the small changes we've made today, uh, we've just added a bit of rebound to the shock and a bit of compression and rebound to the forks um, and a little bit of preload on the shock to stiffen things up a bit. Aside from that, as you would expect to with white power suspension, small changes, uh, small increments and changes make a big difference and that's the quality you get from a KDM motorcycle. <laughs>
So for the full review, check out bikereview.com.au. You'll see all the technical breakouts and so forth there, a lot more in depth than this. And don't forget, subscribe to this channel, comment, share, like this video, and you have a fantastic day. Thanks a lot for watching, I appreciate it.